The San Francisco 49ers division rivals Seattle Seahawks just got a hell of a lot better, and this is how. As I'm sure you've already heard, the Seattle Seahawks have traded for New York Giants Leonard Williams, and this is what they gave up to get him. Honestly, not that much. When you look at it, the Seattle Seahawks gave up a 2024 second round pick and a 2025 fifth round pick to go and get one of the top interior defensive linemen in the NFL. And this obviously has a huge impact to the San Francisco 49ers because now when you look at the defensive line for the Seattle Seahawks, they had the big free agent signing in Draymond Jones. They have Jaron Reed, and of course you add Leonard Williams to the mix. And you also have edges like Boye Mafe, who have been playing a lot better. And, of course, their defense has Jamal Adams, Devin Witherspoon, Quandre Diggs, Tariq Woolen. Their defense just got a whole lot better uh, with this addition of Leonard Williams. And, of course, that now puts the San Francisco 49ers on a bit of notice of what are they going to do. And if you don't remember, they the, the Seahawks already signed Frank Clark, who was recently released from the Denver Broncos. Uh, and they will eventually have Uchenna Nwusu coming back from IR. And so right now, when you look at this defense, they've gotten a lot better and they have the opportunity to get better once they get healthy. So what do the 49ers do in this scenario? This is definitely something that I think needs to put the 49ers on notice. The Seattle Seahawks are five and two while the 49ers sit at five and three. And honestly, the Rams aren't too far behind at three and five. And now you have the Seattle Seahawks with the current number one standing in the NFC West go and get better. So the way that I'm interpreting this is the Seattle Seahawks know exactly that they have the 49ers right where they want them. And they just got better on defense. And that is going to be a challenging addition uh, for the 49ers offensive line when they do play the Seattle Seahawks. So what are the 49ers going to do? Are they going to respond by making a trade of their own, making multiple trades of their own? Their division is not set on just staying how they are. Seattle Seahawks got better. We saw last week the Eagles went out and got Kevin Byard, all pro safety. So Teams that the 49ers will be directly competing with when it comes to playoff time are adding pieces and getting better while the 49ers have lost three games in a row. So what are the 49ers going to do to respond? Are they going to go out and make a trade for a cornerback, for an edge? How do you think the San Francisco 49ers are going to respond to this? Let me know in the comments and also let me know if you think that the Seattle Seahawks got better and if you think this is a direct situation with how the 49ers have been going and how the Seattle Seahawks do believe they have an opportunity to win the West. And they just went out and got better for honestly just a second and a fifth. That's not that much. Um, and especially, especially if Seattle is going to be a contender, that second could be a late second. So what are the 49ers going to do? How are they going to respond to Seattle bolstering their defensive line and continuing to improve their roster? Hopefully we get some trades here in the next couple hours. Uh, the, the trade deadline is almost exactly 24 hours away. And it ends tomorrow on Halloween. What do you think is going to happen with the 49ers? Let me know in the comments below. And as always, make sure to like and subscribe for more updates.